Hello, I am excited to be online here to say hello to you. I miss you all so much. Um, it's not quite the same here at AISL without you, but that's okay. We will, uh, we will make online learning work. So uh, just a few things. I wanted to check in with you. And um, first of all, I'll tell you, thank you so much for getting onto Google Classroom. You're doing an awesome job of learning how to navigate through that system. Do make sure that you watch the video that I sent you that shows you how to submit assignments in Google Classroom. If you're having a hard time, watch the video again. You can also call a friend and a lot of times friends can figure things out that maybe we just need some help with. And so call a friend and see if they can help you with that process as well. Um, let's see here, a few things. I want you to make sure that you're checking into our classroom once every day, Monday through Friday. So you should be doing that with all of your core classes for sure. So whether it's math, it's science, it's social studies or English, make sure that Monday through Friday you're checking into that class, whether it's Google Classroom or something else that has been set up for you. So you stay current and you stay on top of the work that you're supposed to be doing. I'd also suggest that you make a schedule with your parents um, and what you could do is just have a daily schedule so you know what time do I get on and I look at my English homework or what time do I get on and I work on my science projects and if you have a schedule that will help you stay on track uh, you won't get behind that way and then you can also schedule time when you have breaks and you can spend time with friends and be out of the house and those things as well so it's a good way to manage your time your mom and dad can help you with that, uh, setting that up. A um, couple things on homework. Your student introductory assignment, that was that white sheet of paper that had five questions on it. Most of you already submitted that to me. You gave it to me when you came to school on Wednesday. If you already handed it in, in our regular classroom here at school, you don't need to do it again. That's fine. If you forgot it at home or your student that hasn't come to Nigeria yet and you are working on your assignments, then go ahead and submit that through Google Classroom. Please do not email it to me separately. So keep trying to submit it through Google Classroom. It will work. Uh, if you're having a hard time with that, ask your parents for help. Watch the video again or uh, ask a friend as well. The syllabus quiz. Please make sure that you read through the syllabus and answer the, the questions on that quiz. I will give everybody feedback on that uh, in um, some sort of a format. Uh, if I feel like I need to email you individually, I'll do that as well, um, but, I'll, but I'll approach that more as a class discussion sort of a, sort of a feedback for you. So thanks for submitting that online as well. So again, go into Google Classroom, download, answer directly on the sheet and then upload it back into Google Classroom. You should not have to print anything out. Um, there will be uh, a time that I will have some uh, basically office hours where you can be on Google Chat and ask questions and I can answer those. I'm not 100% sure what my daily schedule will be because I know that Mr. Luce and um, some of the other administrators will have uh, teachers in meetings through the week and so I don't want to post hours until I have a better idea what that schedule is but I will let you know early next week what time I will be online to answer those questions. In the meantime you can always email me. Email me at the krail at aislegos.net so the Google Classroom email please. And let's see here. Uh, I wanted to say again, really good job with helping each other out with answering questions on Google Classroom. So if you have a question on an assignment, <clears throat> you're welcome to post that in the stream. And people are doing a good job of kind of jumping in and, and helping out with expectations. I'll jump in there as well if I feel like the answer hasn't been uh, found by somebody else yet. And let's see here. Make sure you're talking to each other. You know, um, one idea that I have about a way to make online school more fun is to 
set up maybe some study times with friends. So maybe you'll go over to somebody's house and a few of you get together and you can work on, work on different assignments together if it's something that's appropriate to do together or just talk about things. Um, so you can definitely rely on your friends a lot. And something coming up, I'm going to start reading a book to you. This is something that I would have started on Monday anyway, so I thought it would be good to start that online, and it's a book called Holes. I don't know if you uh, have ever read this book or have seen the movie, but it's amazing. I always read it to my middle school students, and it's probably one of their favorite books that we read uh, every year. So. I'll, what I'll do is I'll start reading that out loud, just like I'm talking to you right now, post it as a YouTube video, and then I will put that link on Google Classroom, and that way I can, I can share some reading with you. And the last thing that I wanna say is uh, somebody just wanted to stop by and say hi, so I thought that Miss um, Chicken would, you guys would like to be able to say hi to her. She told me that she's missing hearing your voices and seeing you here at school. And so uh, I thought I'd have her drop by as a, as a guest today and maybe we'll see her again. So I think that's about all that I have for you right now. Uh, again, you guys are doing an awesome job. If you feel stressed out about learning online, don't worry. I'm gonna kinda just these last couple days of our first week ease you into Google Classroom. So I'm not going to give you a bunch more assignments this week because I wanna make sure that everybody's feeling comfortable and confident with Google Classroom. And then we'll start fresh again uh, on Monday. But I will be posting a few more things uh, to finish up this week. So stay tuned and make sure you check back every day. Thanks, bye-bye.